Good morning, this is Eromel Magkalas, your subject teacher for Information and Communications Technology, Computer Hardware Servicing 10. Prepare materials and tools used for configuration. Prepare materials and tools used for configuration. A key to a well-tuned trouble free system is proper configuration. In order to accomplish this, you must start by understanding its configuration. It can be difficult to figure out all the devices in your system and the resources they are using. To assist in this, several software tools have been created. These are typically called diagnostic utilities programs. Some of them are built in in your operating system. And the others are available either for free download or commercial purchase. Some of the built-in tools used in Microsoft Systems configuration involves Microsoft System Configuration, Register Edit, DirectX, and last, Control Panel Applets. Microsoft System Configuration This boot configuration utility allows you to set the programs that will run at startup and to edit configuration files. It also offers simplified control over Windows services. System configuration utility consists of five functional tabs. First is the general. Second, boot. Third, services. Fourth, startup. And last is the tools. General tab of system configuration utility. The general tab is the default tab in the system configuration and shows how the computer will start. By default, normal startup should be selected. List of choices for startup configuration. Normal startup starts Windows in the usual manner. Use this mode to start Windows after you are done using the other two modes to troubleshoot the problem. Second, Diagnostic Startup starts Windows with basic services and drivers only. This mode can help rule out. And last is the Selective Settings. It starts Window with basic services and drivers and the other services and startup programs that you select. Boot tab of System Configuration Utility This tab allows you to make the same adjustment you make in the Windows Boot.ini file without having to edit the file. It shows configuration options for the operating system and advanced debugging settings, including the following. Number 1 is the Safe Boot or the Minimal. Boot the Windows Graphics Users Interface in Safe Mode running only critical system services. Networking is disabled. Safe Boot Alternative Shell boots the Windows command prompt in safe mode running only critical system services. Networking and the other graphical user interface are disabled. Safe Boot Active Directory Repair boots the Windows graphical user interface in safe mode running critical system services and active directory. And last is the safe boot network boots the Windows graphical. Services tab of system configuration utility. The services tab allows you to enable or disable any of the Microsoft Windows services or other program services running on the computer. When the computer boots, along with their status running or stop, by checking the Hide All Microsoft Services box at the bottom of the window, you can see all non-Windows services such as driver services and program services that are open and cause of startup problems. And checking the box will disable the service from starting. Warning! 
Disabling services that normally run at boot time might cause some program to malfunction or result in system instability. Do not disable services in this list unless you know they are not essential to your computer's operation. Startup tab of System Configuration Utility The Startup tab is one of the most frequent reasons most Windows users enter the System Configuration Utility. In the Startup tab, you will be able to see the list of applications that run when the computer boots, along with the name of their publisher, the path to the executable file, and the location of the registry key or shortcut that causes the application to run. These startup programs are often one of the biggest causes for a computer to start up and run slowly. Windows 8 Microsoft has removed this startup feature in the system configuration utility and moved it into the Windows 8 Task Manager. Uncheck any program that you want to disable from starting up each time. Note, disabling applications that normally run at boot time might result in related applications starting more slowly or not running as expected. Tools tab of System Configuration Utility This provides a convenient list of diagnostic tools and other advanced tools that you can run. Register Edit This application allows you to edit the registry. The Windows registry usually referred to as the registry is a collection of database of configuration settings in Microsoft Windows operating systems. In Windows 2000 and Windows XP, the registry is stored in several hives located in the following pod. Thank you for listening. This has been Sir O.